Yo, what is going on guys? Welcome back to another video. Now today's video is how you can hack Plants vs Zombies using Cheat Engine. So, I'm playing Plants vs Zombies on my laptop, or your PC works fine as well. I'm playing it through Bluestacks, which is an Android emulator. Um, you can, well, you'll probably have to search up another video on how to download Bluestacks, but it's really simple, to be honest. You don't really need a video. <clears throat> so, like, you can just search up um, Bluestacks download on Chrome or whatever. And the first result, well, you can just use that one. So, yeah. So, Bluestacks 5 is the latest one. Which is, that's the one that I'm using. That's just what it looks like. And here, this is my game, Plants for Zombies. And you just log in with your Google and whatever. So, yeah. So, I have my Plants for Zombies open on my laptop. And I have my Cheat Engine open. Cheat Engine, uh, link is in the description. But I also have a video on how to download it if you want to check that out. So, yeah. So, I've got my game open. And I've got my Cheat Engine open. So, what you want to do first is on cheat engine you want to click on the little monitor logo here it's a little monitor monitor logo with the magnifying glass on it so you want to click on it and so you'll be um, you'll find this process list here and on this you want to click on processes because it'll probably show you applications first but you want to click on processes and you want to scroll down until you find hdplayer.exe and it has the bluestacks logo right next to it it depends on what uh, emulator you're using, but I'm just using Bluestacks and it has the logo next to it. So this is what it'll look like hdplayer.exe with the Bluestacks logo next to it. Click on open and so here you are. So you've got the Bluestacks, the game open, right, with Cheat Engine. So this is where it starts. So for an example, as you can see my coins and my gems, right? Very hacked, obviously. I did not grind for that. No one can get that legitly. That's way too much. So what I'm going to do first is Actually, so yeah, okay, so your number, right? You have to type in your number here in this little box that says value. So my number is, you know, uh, for my coins, it's 1 billion 49, right? 1 billion 499, okay? So I'm gonna type in that number because that's the number of my coins, okay? So I'm gonna type that in. So I'm gonna type in 1, 0, 0, 0, 0, 0, 0. 499 and you've got to type it exactly if not it will not work and then once you've typed it in put first scan now on there it says found right so my number is very specific so that's why there's not that many addresses that it's found so it's going to be very easy for me so just to sh just to demonstrate real quick that it works i'm going to select all of them right and when you select them all click on the red arrow and it'll bring them down here and you click on one control a and then you right click change record and you click on value and just to show you i'll change it to 999999999 so 999999999 all right so okay and as you can see in the game they have changed to 999 million right just to i mean it's not that much of a difference but just to show you that you can actually change the values and that it works so now for you you might have done it already right you've put in your number and you've put first scan right and for you it's found maybe like 200 different uh, addresses right for me it found four because obviously 1 billion is a very specific number what I had yours might be like 10,320 or whatever right so for just for the video I'll change my number to like 10,329 for an example right 10,329 okay so as you can see in my game they've changed to 10,329 right here so um i'm gonna just delete these down here we don't need them delete all the addresses yes and i'm gonna click on new scan you don't have to do this this is just me um trying to show you okay so now so th this is where you can start to follow so now i have a number similar to yours maybe or maybe you have 100k it doesn't matter but i've got this number right i've got 10,329 so i'm going to type that into the box of the value so 10 3 2 9 and I'll click first scan. And so here we go, it says found 325. Okay. So now you want to go into the store of the game or you want to change that value. It doesn't matter how you do it, but you got to change it. So I'm in the store and I'm just going to buy this, right? Because I got to change the value. So skip, 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 continue. Yeah, sure. So now my value has changed to 8,329. So I am going to change this to eight three two nine and i'm going to click on next scan and there you go it's found one which is the number of coins that i have so i'm going to click on it click on the right the red arrow sorry 
and I'm going to right click it and then you want to change record value and so now here you can change it and I'm going to put 999999999 right and to actually see the number there and to be able to use the coins well actually well no actually well yeah you can still use them it'll change but you got to refresh your page or your your game right like the anyways okay so just get out of the store is what i'm saying this is how you refresh your game and as you can see the coins have changed now to 999 million. and yeah so the same works with gems as well and the candies there and also the little plants that i have there and yeah that is it um if you have any problems or questions on downloading Chi Engine or BlueStacks, just let me know in the comments and I'll be sure to help you out. I'm very active in the comments, so always just, uh, always expect a reply from me. And yeah, that is it. Uh, see you in the next video. Peace.